three-wheel rollator with handlebars and a pouch. Your three-wheel rollator kit arrives in a semi-assembled state. The kit consists of five distinct parts. Main rollator frame assembly with wheels pre-installed. Pair of handlebars with handbrakes pre-installed. Set of plastic knobs and steel bolts. Wire basket assembly. Plastic tray. Assemble the main rollator frame. Set the main rollator frame assembly upright and spread the sides apart. Push the spring-loaded security lock on top of the frame all the way out, making sure it clicks into place. This will prevent the frame from accidentally folding onto itself. Assemble the wheels. Firmly grab one of the rear wheel frames and pull it out until you hear it click into place. If done right, you should see the quick lock pin pop out from the hole in the upper tube. Grab one of the steel bolts and insert it into the hole in the lower tube from the inside of the frame. Align the pentagon shape of the bolt's head with the pentagon shaped indentation on the tube. Secure the bolt with a plastic knob on the outside of the frame. Screw it all the way, but do not over tighten. The wheel is now secured. Assemble the handlebar. Make sure the logo on the handle is facing out. Insert the handlebar into the corresponding tube of the rollator. Align one of the pre-drilled holes on the handle with a hole in the rollator tube. Choose the hole in the handle that corresponds to the height of the person who will use the rollator. You can also adjust the height of the handle by choosing a different hole later when the rollator is fully assembled. Insert one of the steel bolts into the hole from the inside of the frame. You may have to wiggle the handle slightly to make the bolt go all the way through. Align the pentagon shape of the bolt's head with a pentagon shaped indentation on the tube. Secure the bolt with a plastic knob on the outside of the frame. Screw it all the way, but do not over tighten. The handle is now secured. Repeat the wheel and the handlebar assembly procedure for the other side of the rollator. When you are done, push the handbrake all the way down to lock the wheels. This will prevent the rollator from sliding around and getting away. Assemble the wire basket. Begin by unfolding the top and the side flaps. Bring one of the side flaps and the top flap back up. Snap them together, first using the hook on the top flap and then the second hook on the side flap as seen on the video. Repeat the procedure for the other side flap. The wire basket is now assembled and ready to be installed onto the rollator. Install the wire basket. Notice the opening on the bottom of the basket. Bring the wire basket to the top of the rollator and place it between the handlebars so that the plastic knob of the security lock goes through the opening on the bottom of the basket. Fasten the basket to the handlebars with the corresponding hooks on the back of the basket. The basket is now secured. Installing the plastic tray. Place the plastic tray on top of the basket. Make sure the rounded corners of the tray are facing forward and the grooves on the bottom of the tray are aligned with the top of the wire basket. Gently push the tray down until it snaps into place. Adjusting the brakes. At some point, you might want to adjust the brakes on your rollator. Use the Phillips head screwdriver to loosen up the little screw that holds the brake wire in place. Adjust the wire according to your needs. Do not forget to tighten the screw after you're done. 
your three-wheel rollator is fully assembled and ready to go. Now you can enjoy long, satisfying walks around your neighborhood. You can also take your rollator with you anywhere by folding it up in mere seconds and safely storing it in the trunk of your car. Easy to assemble, sturdy and reliable, three-wheel rollator with handle brakes and a pouch from Healthline USA will help you get wherever and whenever you want and enjoy the fully active lifestyle you truly deserve.